Do you know the FBI, here's an interesting story. When the uh, defense attorneys started to demand access to the footage for the purpose of defending their clients from conspiracy, meaning working together to, for an insurrection requires coordination. You can't just have 100 people independently insurrecting. It has to be a coordinated thing to be an insurrection. Uh, so, they, so the defense attorney said, all right, we're going to defend our clients on the base of the fact that there was no networking or coordination. You will not be able to prove it. You've got all their cell phones. You've got their surveillance. You're not going to prove that. We, however, are going to counter with the argument there may be networking against them on the government's part. We want footage. We want to, we want to be able to explore who the underground agents are. We won't reveal them, but we have to have information Suddenly, Anna, the FBI came up with a unique conclusion. We're wrapping up the case because we see no evidence of collusion amongst the insurrection participants. This appears to be all independent. There was no networking. They shut down the investigation so they couldn't be investigated. Catch what I said? The news didn't cover it. They didn't want the footage forensically reviewed in public because it would expose the agents they've got embedded in the Proud Boys, in the Oath Keepers, in the One Percenters, and in the uh, altercation with the police and the guy that you saw, who's Harold Epps, who was actually organizing militia for two days trying to create a breach, That's working right. for the government. 